hello, hello. My name is Callista and welcome back to Dragon Age 2. In the last episode, we got started on Mark of the Assassin. We arrived at Chateau Hain, however, no one can actually get into the keep until someone finds and kills a wyvern. So we do have to be on the lookout for the creatures. However, let's be brutally honest, the far more important task, finding this guy's dogs. They are lost and alone out there. And I mean, Amelia is Ferelden. Wyverns versus dogs, that, that is an easy call in Amelia's mind. Ooh, hello. Uh, hopefully this is wyvern blood and not dog blood. A lot of blood. Would that be prey or from a wyvern itself? I've heard they fight for dominance. Can't be gentle. Maybe we can use some to draw out rivals. Okay. That's good. We have something to lure a wyvern in. We just need a few more things. You know, a, a decent spot. Oh, I... <laughs> so I mentioned before, I don't really remember much of this DLC. Like, I remember all of the story beats, but like the individual maps, some puzzle answers, I don't really remember. This, however, this, however, I remember with perfect clarity. That altar is very old and creepy. I wouldn't touch it. Yeah, yeah. if I were sane, I wouldn't touch it either. Um, however, I actually don't have the quest for this just yet. So I'm, I'm going to make a mental note that that's where that is. And we're going to come back to it. Champion of Kirkwall? Fancy title. The only one in Kirkwall not completely insane was considered. <laughs> So, do you get a stipend? They let you rule the city? They gave me a medal. It's shiny. <laughs> I love that Hawk gets banter in this DLC. I'm like, you've got a, you've got a voiced protagonist. You might as well let them weigh in on banter and stuff. Okay. Now then, hello. Dragonlings, hi. You're doing all right. Uh, go, go, go. Paste it up and summon puppy. There we go. And, oh dear. Um, oh, oh god, even, even bigger dragons. However, uh, I've just realised all of my people are ranged. Oh no. I may have made a bad decision here. Fuck it, I'll, I'll stick with it. I stand by my decisions. Okay, come on. Ooh, Talis. Talis, I've got you, girl. I've got you. No, no, no. Bugger off. And now, run away. Go, Amelia. There we go. Okay, everyone's doing okay for health. Come on, take him down. Take him down. Stop going after our lover. There we go. Good job, guys. Uh, excuse me? I would would like. There we go. Invigorating, but I doubt that was the point of the hunt. Do dragons and wyverns even mix? I don't think so. So if we drop part of this in the right spot, we might lure a wyvern out to protect its territory. Good thought. Do that. Add it to what we have already. Is it enough to draw one out of hiding? I'd say so. A little one. Probably all we need. In the right spot, no doubt. A little one, though. I mean... And now is the perfect time to settle old grudges. Amelia is Ferelden and she's going up against Orlesians. She just, she doesn't want to beat them by like a little. She wants to thoroughly trounce them. So, you know, a little one, mm, I think we can do better than that. I think we can do much better than that. 
Now that just, let me double check, I'm feeling paranoid. Yeah, we looted everything. We looted everything there. Okay, so this leads back around to the very beginning of the hunting grounds. Okay, there's, there's this little path up here. Alrighty then. Now then, I am on the lookout for the, um, the Master's Salve items. Because I, I believe two of the ingredients can be found in this area of the hunting grounds. And, you know, it, it is important, I'm, I'm gonna say that, it is kind of important that you go and, uh, get that. Now what's this? Hmm. A hidden area with... Andraste's mantle. There we go. Oh shit. Is that Wyvern's mating? Could we mimic that? No. Oh, the sound. Right, yes. I can try that. Talis, I'm still not hitting on you. As much as a crush as I have on Felicia Day. Um like it's my my hatred of Talis supersedes my Felicia Day crush. I'm like, mm, no, thank you. Also, can I just note this guy got murdered by cheese. This I I want to know what kind of cheese this is that it dropped on a guy and he was just like, well, my life ceases to exist. Like what what cheese is that heavy? God, I, I could go for some cheese right now. I love cheese. Oh, my God. A really nice brie with some cranberry jam. Oh, that that sounds beautiful to me. Um, So we... This, this way leads to the eastern section of the hunting grounds. We did see some people run off down there. However, um, I noticed... Aha, Drake Vane, there we go. Lovely jubbly, and that just leaves the third ingredient. I think it was something like winterberry? Something, something, you know, fancy and kind of elven sounding. You're right. Hello? There is something in there. A nest, perhaps. <laughs> Guys, God, you you have a little hole in the ground, and you can hear like weird laughing. Come on, Amelia, attack the damn thing! Yet you can hear weird laughing coming from this hole, and your instinct is, well, I should put my face in the hole. No, nobody. That is incorrect. Okay, you. Up. There, are an, there are a lot of them, but they don't seem to be chunky, which is very good. Come on, take him out. Everyone's doing A-OK -okay for health. Puppy is still up, I think. Oh, hello. You're right. Okay. I, excuse you. Bugger off. and dress his name with those ghasts cave creatures they don't come out on the surface much however maybe they were out gathering hunters and us uh, at that mm, he's got jokes he tries to do jokes like he did in awakening oh that just makes me sad i i miss and as, as he was in Awakening. Like, whenever we get snippets of that in Dragon Age 2, as I said, it just makes me feel sad. It doesn't make me go like, hey, he used to be like that. I'm like, he's fallen so far and suffered so much and done so many horrible, horrible things. And as why. Now then, hello. Oh, sir. 
Lost Scholar, why are you half naked in the woods? What were you studying where getting half naked in the woods was the appropriate research tactic? Sir, were you trying to snort some winterberry? Is that it? Oh, blessed Andraste, thank you. I thought I'd die out here. I've been trapped here since last night. Do, do I even want to ask, mate? I know I'm going to regret this, but why are you standing out here in your small clothes? Ghasts were chasing me. I thought I could leave false trails. The truth told, I'm not looking for the women. I'm a scholar from Cumberland, researching an Avar cult that once lived here. They worship the Lady of the Skies to the exclusion of all other gods. I'm searching for their shrine. Uh, well, I actually already found an altar pretty close by. I've seen something that might be the shrine you're looking for. Then you have succeeded where I failed. The rumors say they were driven from their last refuge. They left a great treasure in the goddess's keeping. <sighs> but the mountain has defeated me. Please, take my research and see if you can do anything with it. I will try to make it back to camp. Good luck to you, Sarah. Well, you should be perfectly safe, mate. I mean, we, we cleared out the ghasts. I, I'm, I'm inclined to chase him. One, I find it amusing. Two, just, just to make sure he gets back there safely. You know, he doesn't take any random ass shortcuts and ends up as wiven food. God, look at him run. And in bare feet. Or did someone create them? The sooner we get uh, the hunt over with, the sooner we'll be at the chateau to finish this. I've I've paused because I Do you mean the Wivens or the ghasts? Also, what do you mean? Like, are they natural or did someone create them? Like, my first thought was that like, is Anders insinuating someone fucked a dragon? Like the bards finally did their job. And they, they screwed the high dragon and a wyvern popped out and everyone just went, oh, okay. Or, I mean, ghasts are vaguely humanoid, but again, that's disturbing. Like, who? Disturbing and illegal. Don't, don't, don't put your dick in animals. That ain't right. That's not, mm, no. Now then, I, I will read the codex entry we got before... We start fucking about with the uh, Avar shrines. Amelia may think that the Avars were talking out of their asses, but, you know, she she knows better than to just be like, I'ma take your shit. Doing all right, bud? This is where we separate off. Yeah, he's got this. He's fine. He's all good. Now then, let's see. We should also, yes, ghast. The ghast is a small, vicious creature that dwells in mountain caves. One is little more than a nuisance and will flee if threatened. A pack of five or more, however, is much bolder and can easily overwhelm a bear. Although ghasts are cunning and able to cooperate for survival, they show no signs of true intelligence. They are unable to speak, communicating only through grunts and squeals. Grunts, squeals, and shit that sounds remarkably like laughter. I don't trust any animal that can laugh. If it can laugh, then it, like, it has bad intentions. I'm telling you, like, that, that is a fact. Nothing can change my mind on that. Okay, yes, notes on the Avar Sky Cult. Every Avar holy site, regardless of clan or deity, has a well-hidden opening in the altar, which would be aligned with the rising sun on the winter solstice, where the sacred relics of the god or goddess would be enshrined. This would never be removed, even in dire emergency, for fear of angering the gods. Avar tales from the Divine Age are filled with warnings about those who mistreat or show the least disrespect to altars of the Lady of the Skies. Unfortunately, the superstitious Avars counted a host of innocuous things as disrespectful, including speaking, coughing, holding any objects in your right hand, and possessing anything containing feathers. 
It is unlikely there is any real danger in approaching the shrine. Anything containing feathers or anders, you might be fucked, mate. You are very, um, befeathered. Like, your, your pauldrons might upset the Lady of the Skies. Would you consider taking it off? He won't take it off. He is, he is far too attached to those feathers of his. Then again, Amelia, Amelia wouldn't pay any notice to that. You know, there is no Lady of the Skies. It's heretical nonsense. You know, they, they simply, you know, they didn't understand that the one true God is the Maker. So clearly there's no danger here. That must be the altar of that weird old guy mentioned. What do his notes say? Well, the notes say that approaching the altar is fine. I guess that scholar was right about something. I've got kind of a bad feeling about this place, though. Yes. Yes, indeed. I might be screwed here. Now, if you take the sacrificial dagger and the girdle of the skies, nothing will happen. Everything will be calm. However, if you take the Book of the Lady, bad shit will happen. And because I am a cocky person, I'm going to take everything. I told, <laughs> I told you not to mess around with it. Okay, gloat all you want, Talus. This is an incredibly difficult fight. Run quickly. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna warn you right now. I don't know if I'm gonna get this. Because this is an extremely difficult fight, guys. You are gonna want to move and you are gonna want to move quickly. Also, Amelia, I don't like you being there. You might be a bit too close. There we go. Well, I'm gonna say, this is going a lot better than I thought it was. Because he, he has two main attacks. The purple mist thing, which drains you kind of slowly. And he also has like a, um, a blue light that emanates from him. Which drains you real fucking quick. So, ugh, be, be on the lookout for that. Okay, come on. Everyone is doing okay. Dane is still up. Uh, you can bugger off. There we go. Okay. And he's coming back in. So move over there. What did I say? What did I say? Anders. Move over there, please. Oh god, they're down. They're down, but I can get them back up. Uh, who are you attacking? You are going after this guy, right? Yes, there we go. Oh shit. Drink a potion. Drink a potion quickly. There we go. <laughs> oh, and I think he healed us. Thank you, love. Thank you for being helpful. Move over here, because he should. He's, he's going to do the wub wub thing at some point. I know he is. I don't, excuse you. Oh. Now's the time. And Brupeel? Shit! Drink a potion. If, as long as we have one healer, we are fine. And then, uh, yes. Brupeel. There we go. One healer and we are good, but if if both of them go down, I'm fucked. I can't do this. Okay, okay, and move away. Move away. I don't trust it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. I, I have no heals. Do a regroup. Please do a regroup quickly. 
Okay, okay. 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 Heal yourself. And then get these on quick. Okay. Okay. This is this is all right. This is all right. It we've still got this. Okay. Woo. Oh my god, and my my heart is in my throat right now. What's happening? What's going on? He's He's a third of the way down. There's a Sky Priest over there. Okay. Okay, just be chill. Be cool. We, we, we can still do this. We can still do this. And Reese and Puppy. There we go. Every little bit helps. Okay, you're down. Okay, how long? Ah, uh, okay. No healing, sir. I saw that. And you can bugger off. There we go. No, 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 no. Don't get too close. Where are you going? Oh, do, 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 do. You. And I think he should be popping up right about there. Yep. Heal up Talus. Oh! No! 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 Can you can you drink? Please tell me you can drink, because if I'm alone and I don't have a revive. God damn! Okay. It's we we have Poppy! We have Poppy! There's a guy! Get on him. I have no attacks. I have no attacks. Drink. Drink, girl. Drink for your life. Okay. I am keeping such a close eye on everything. No. No, you don't. No, you don't, dickhead. Thanks. That's the blue light. That kills you so quickly. Oh my god. Keep on him. Keep on him. And then heal yourself just in case. No. 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 I refuse. Come on, Amelia. We have no... Group it's heal. Group heal. You. Mm. I'm not I'm not going down without a fight. Never give in. Never surrender. Okay, okay, okay. 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 We can, we can regroup in like a minute. In like a minute. Where are you going? Where are you going? Come on. I need... Assistance! I can't do this on my own! And I don't have to! Okay, okay, I do. I need healing! I need healing! Shit! That was so fucking lucky. Anders, move! Anders, why the fuck aren't you moving? Anders, you had one job, and that job was move your ass. Oh my god. We were so close. We were so close. And that that is my first TPK. My first TPK. Old guy mentioned. What do his notes say? You know, I can I can be happy with that. We are almost at the end of the game, and that is a difficult fight. And I went out swinging. Am I immediately gonna do that again? 
I I will not take no for an answer. Give me everything. I told that was such bad luck, though. And I think Anders must have revived in a place that he couldn't move from. Because literally, if Anders had moved, we would have won that. Oh, that. That's bad luck. That's just bad luck. Okay, no, 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 no. Go after this guy. Focus on him. Oh, Tal there goes Talus. Good job, love. Okay, no. You can get into Panacea. And if you could do a regroup. There we go. And then you can go out of that. I'm, I'm gonna just turn that on and off as I will. Okay, come on. Oh, do, 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 do. what's that? Oh, that's Talus. Okay, that's fine. I thought there were two assassins there for a minute. Okay. Everyone is doing fine for health. No, 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 don't. We wait for you to come in. Mm -mm -mm -mm. And Farrick, go over there. Mm -mm -mm. Okay. Farrick, you had better be moving away from that. There we go. Talus is down again, but what can you do? Nope, 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 nope. Run Amelia, run Amelia. And drink a potion. There we go. Where did it go? Nope. No, thank you, sir. I'm not dealing with your bullshit. Come on. Take it out. Okay, it's, it's down to like half health again. You're not gonna have another revive for a little while. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. Ooh, Nelly. When you get up, heal yourself. There we go. Is, a dog is down. Dog is down, but it's okay. Okay, come on. Paste it up. And who am I fighting? You! Okay, there we go. You know what? Take out the mage. They're far more dangerous. Okay. And once again, Anders, how is... Okay. We'll probably both have a revive at roughly the same time. Now, bugger off. There we go. And recent the dog. No! No! No, you don't. No, you don't. Okay, um... I don't want to get closer to it. Run! Quickly run! There we go. You know what? Into Panacea. And I don't know what you're doing, but if you could do a group heal, that'd be great. And then you can exit that. It's okay. We have health potions. Come on, drink, girl, drink. There we go. Varric is down. But the two healers are still up. You know what? You just you just move a little bit further back, bud. 
No, 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 no. Focus on him. Okay. Okay, every... Mm, no, you don't. No, you don't. And his, and his revive is up. To move. Okay, and then... Heal yourself. Oh, there goes me timer. However, I'm not... I am not stopping until I have gotten past this fight. You run over here in case he does his wub wub thing again. Um... Wait, are you out of mana? There we go. Revive. And then you. Group heal. We're tag teaming this. There we go. Aha, tag team. There we go. Okay, you can you can I you can be ignored. Talis. Go after him. You um back it up. Shit! You're so close to getting out of there. Okay. And haste it up. Go, go, go. Just focus in on him. Oh, he buggered off. Where? Where did you go? I have no bloody clue. Nope. No, no, no. You can't get me with the whoop whoop thing. No, thank you. Anders, Anders, Anders. Why did you go over there? Run over there, bud. A juggernaut. Second time's the charm. Hey, I knew we could take it down with this party. That that first got that was just bad luck. I'm telling you, Anders getting stuck like that was just bad luck. Oh, that was a good fight though. I enjoyed that. Alrighty then. In the next episode, we loot the bodies. They are rightfully ours, as is their loot. But until then, please remember to like if you enjoyed, leave a comment below. And if you wanted to subscribe, it would be very much appreciated. I've been Callista. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode.